So, uh, favorite scene in Pretty Woman? Well, I mean, there's so many, but, uh, <laughs> I do like that part just right at the end when he comes up in the limo and, um, she's up on the fire escape and everything. That's, that's a pretty nice moment. Kind of like, we could probably do something like that right here. Hey, Fee. Hey, Freddy. I have a feeling I'll be playing the Richard Gere character and you'll be playing the Julia Roberts one. That's a typical role for me, for yeah. sure. Five minutes with Freddy. Five minutes with Freddy. So you did this amazing thing on Craigslist where you uh, had your album for sale. Mm -hmm. So um, what I need to do today is sell all these items. And I thought since you're such a master at doing that, you could help me um, kind this, of... This is a great idea. Well, you got some big ticket items here. I mean, what can we write you're in looking ads? at six, seventeen dollars minimum. <laughs> this is a it's a single glove for smokers in the winter. Beautiful. What do you think? What could we put in the ad for this? Well, I think your first line there was probably the strongest. You're going to want to open with that for sure. You don't want to rule out the other options because obviously texting is a big thing nowadays for young people. Right. Um, having one hand free to do that is quite important. So. You know, you hold the phone with the gloved hand, leaving your right hand free for the texting. I think you should incorporate that into the ad for sure. That'll appeal to a lot of youngsters. It's for selling points. Yeah. Also, it's a beautiful shade of faded brown. I think this is real. Um, you know what's funny is when I was putting my ad on Craigslist, I actually saw the guy who's trying to sell the back half of that. <laughs> yeah. Got this lint roller, but it's only good for, not, not so much for clothes, but getting the excess hair off cats. Right. If you've done it, you need to to drink. I've never slept in a bathtub. Okay. I've never ate off a stranger's floor. Okay. I've never been told to tone down the dirty dancing. Big dancer. <sighs> shake it, shake it, tail Yeah, sure. I'm, I don't know. I'm, I, I like dancing. I don't know. I think I'm probably good. To, I'm pretty good at it. Thank you. I appreciate you saying so. <laughs> no, I've never been told. I, in fact, I've been told to turn it up. <laughs> and bring it up. Yeah. What's the worst birthday present you've ever got? I'd say the worst birthday present I ever got was uh, not one, but two pairs of uh, neon colored jeans. <laughs> My mother got them for me. They said Joe Cool on the side. Is this a couple weeks ago? It was just a couple weeks ago. I mean, I could at least make 23 bucks on all this stuff today. Lint roller? I'm flattered that you're interested in my music, and I'm I'm really thrilled to be here. So thanks very much for having me. And uh, I hope I run into you outside of this place as well. You know, maybe in a coffee shop or in a restaurant or something like that. And we can, we can see how the Craigslist ads did. I really do hope we run into each other in a coffee shop. Maybe share a latte. Yeah. I don't know. It's good to see him though. Good to see him. Five minutes with Freddy Five minutes with Freddy